And a couple more races we want to highlight. Proposition B, asking Missourians to increase the minimum wage in the state. And if we take a look at that, it appears that uh, this proposition is passing. Missourians saying they do want a pay bump for minimum wage. A yes vote was 61% of the votes, and this is with 73% of precincts reporting. Um, let's go ahead and go to Frances Lynn. She is in our studio tonight to explain what exactly this means. Um, you were actually at Teamsters Hall on Division Street earlier this evening uh, talking to supporters of Proposition V, Frances. Yeah, Heather, David. So Missouri's current state minimum wage is $7.85 per hour, which is not considered a living wage defined as what a person needs to pay for basic needs like food, housing, medical, and taxes. Proposition B on the ballot today will increase the state minimum wage to $8.60 per hour, with an $0.85 cent per hour increase each year until 2023, when the wage would be $12 per hour. I was at the watch party for Greene County Democrats and people I spoke to were in support of raising the minimum wage. Representative Crystal Quaid says this issue is an important one. You know, we have um, one of the lowest minimum wages around, um, and we have a lot of folks who are struggling. A single mom living on minimum wage with children is, it comes out to be about $300 a week. That is just not enough money to live on. So I'm excited that uh, the people said, um, you know, to the Missouri legislature that we want to raise the minimum wage. Government employers and businesses with a less than $500,000 annual income would not be required to pay this state minimum wage.